So the question is whether sodium acetate, that's the CH3COONA, is acetic, basic, or neutral when it's put in water. So to solve that, we need to have the equation for what produces the sodium acetate, and that's the acetic acid plus sodium hydroxide. That produces acetate in water. This is a neutralization reaction. And then we have some rules here that'll help us. So once we have this, we have to figure out the strength of the acid and the base involved. Really, the way to do that is just to memorize these. So we have this chart here, and let's see what we have. This acetic acid here is over here, and it's a weak acid. So we'll write weak acid above here. Sodium hydroxide is a strong base. It's right here, strong base. So with this, we can figure out whether CH3COONA, the sodium acetate, is going to be acetic, basic, or neutral when it's dissolved in water. So we look down our rules here. We see with a weak acid and a strong base, the pH, that's greater than 7. That's going to be alkaline or basic. So in answer to our question, if you put the sodium acetate in water, the solution, the resulting solution, will be slightly alkaline. It'll be above a pH of 7. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.